Hey guys, the objective of this video is to show you the process and how to find the general solution to this second order differential equation. So let's begin our first step, which is to change it into characteristic form. We have m squared plus m minus 2 equals to 0. So the characteristic form of the second order differential equation lets us solve it and find roots for m. So if we factor this, we get bracket m minus 1 equals to 0. And therefore we know our factors is m equals to negative 2 or m equals to 1. If we look up here at our table, I've written this down, there's only three types of roots. We have two distinct roots, which is the case that we have here. Or we can have a repeated root or a complex root. So in this case we have two distinct roots. We look at the general solution, which tells us that y would equal to some constant, c1, e to our first root, so negative 2, x plus another constant, e to the 1x, which is just x. And this is our answer to the question. As you can see, solving these type of problems is not difficult in the homogeneous case. However, it gives us the building tools to solve harder differential equations later on. So I hope this video helped and I'll be seeing you in other differential equation videos where we'll be looking at the single root case and the complex root case.